Hey everyone. So I received this uh, microphone from uh, Fine Fine or Fa Fine. Uh, anyway, there's a link below in the description. They asked me to do a quick review. Um, I did receive it from them in order to do a review, so I didn't pay for it. Um, and we'll see if I'm going to use it at all. But here it is. Let's see. So it is a, a USB mic. This reminds me of the old fashioned mics where it was just this gooseneck thing. This thing's got this gooseneck. Um, it's, uh, sorry about my mess here. Let's see. Gooseneck. That's pretty cool. Um, let's, uh, let's zoom out on this camera here. So we see a little bit more of it. It's a USB mic. We've got a volume knob and a mute button. This is plastic, but that's metal. So I can point it at me. There we go. All right, so the best way for me to do this review is simply to plug it in and add it to my OBS and we'll see how it sounds side by side with my uh, RE20 back. So what I did was um, I plugged it in. Um, here's what it looks like. It's about, it's almost a foot. And I'm gonna add it to OBS. Let's add a, go to my all inputs and add an audio input capture. There we go. So on one side is the fine fine mic and we should be hearing both of them actually. Uh, I will take this down a little bit because we'll make them both even. And uh, we're probably hearing both of them now because both lines are moving. So I'm going to turn one on and turn one off. So um, let's see where these are. Let's just take a look. I'm going to push this down here. So here is my RE20. And here is the fine fine mic. All right. So we're going to turn off the fine fine. Testing one, two, three, four. This is my RE20. Testing one, two, three, four. And testing one, two, three, four. This is the fine fine mic. And I can turn it up and down. Give it a little bit more gain, can I? Up and down. Oh, it's all the way up. Testing one, two. And let's do it all the way down. down. And testing one, two. We'll bring it up a little bit. Testing one, two, three, four. I'm going to press the mute button. That definitely muted it. Now we'll switch back to the other one. Testing one, two, three, four. Testing one, two, three, four. Testing one, two. Check one, two, three, four. Check one, two, three, four. All right, well, there we are. Uh, my name is Scott Parker from Scott Parker Tech Tips, and I'm doing some gear reviews. I've done cameras, and I've done another microphone. I'm going to do another mic uh, very shortly. The next review will be a different company mic. Let's go back to the other mic. My name is Scott Parker from Scott Parker's Tech Tips. This is the Fi Fine mic. This is uh, this mic here. Okay, from this company. There's a link to it in down there. It's like 25 bucks. Uh, if you buy it from my link, I get a small commission from Amazon. So I'm about to listen to it and we'll find out if I like it or not. But you be the judge. Because now you've heard it on two different mics. A $450 mic and a $25 mic. So for $25, bucks, it's not a bad deal. I will say that it picked up a lot of desk noise. Whenever I touched it or touched the desk, it would pick stuff up. So if I were to put this on my desk... I would put it on a small foam pad or a folded up washcloth or that sort of thing to give it a little cushioning underneath. Um, I could see using this, especially for my technical theater work, having it on my tech table. Hit that mute button. You don't have to worry about hitting anything else. If you're doing Zoom calls and that sort of thing. So Scott Parker's Tech Tips, please like and subscribe. Let me know what other kind of microphones you guys use, and we'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye-bye.